नमस्कार मैं हूं पायल गुडियाल दुनिया के सबसे बड़े लोकतंत्र के सबसे लोकप्रिय नेता प्रधानमंत्री नरेंद्र मोदी के नाम एक और रिकॉर्ड दर्ज हो गया है डिस्कवरी के शो मैन वर्सेस वाइल्ड में पीएम मोदी और बेयर ब्लिस की जोड़ी ने ऐसा धमाल मचाया है कि ये शो दुनिया का सबसे ज्यादा देखे जाने वाला शो बन गया है इस शो को केवल भारत में ही नहीं बल्कि पूरी दुनिया में देखा गया ये शो इतना पॉपुलर हुआ कि आज भी टेलीविजन की दुनिया में टॉप ट्रेंडिंग में चल रहा है इस शो ने महज कुछ दिनों में ही टीवी जगत के एक बड़े शो सुपर बाउल 53 को भी पीछे छोड़ दिया है इस शो को अब तक 3.6 बिलियन इम्प्रेशन भी मिल चुके हैं जो अब तक किसी टीवी शो को मिले सबसे ज्यादा इम्प्रेशन है इस बात की जानकारी खुद शो के होस्ट बेयर ग्रिल्स ने ट्वीट कर दी है बेयर ग्रिल्स ने लिखा की पी नरेंद्र मोदी के साथ फिल्म गए स्पेशल एपिसोड को 3.6 बिलियन सोशल मीडिया इंप्रेशन मिल चुके हैं इसने टीवी जगत के एक बड़े शो सुपर बाउल 53 को भी ट्रेंडिंग के मामले में पीछे छोड़ दिया है सुपर बाउल 53 को 3.4 बिलियन सोशल मीडिया इंप्रेशन मिले हैं बेयर ग्रिल्स ने उन सभी दर्शकों का शुक्रिया अदा किया है जिन्होंने शो को देखा मैन वर्सेज वाइल्ड डिस्कवरी चैनल पर आने वाला पॉपुलर शो है इस शो में बेयर ग्रिल्स खतरनाक स्टंट करते हुए दिखाई देते हैं पीएम मोदी के साथ ये शो उत्तराखंड के जिम कॉर्बेट पार्क में शूट हुआ था जहां पीएम मोदी बेयर ग्रिल्स के साथ अपनी जिंदगी से जुड़े कई पहलुओं पर चर्चा करते हुए दिखाई दिए थे ग्रिल्स ने घने जंगलों और खतरनाक जानवरों के बीच पीएम मोदी के साथ ये शो शूट किया था उन्होंने इन भयानक परिस्थितियों में भी मोदी के धैर्य और सहजता की तारीफ की थी दरअसल बेयर ने खुद कहा था की ये देखना बेहद दिलचस्प था की खतरनाक हालात में भी मोदी उन्हें काफी सपोर्ट कर रहे थे Well it's interesting I think it's you know often you just see politicians behind a podium in a suit looking smart uh but you know the wild is a great leveler it doesn't care who you are it rewards commitment and courage and you got to work together and we actually got hit by some really big storms and torrential rain whilst we were there even just the off camera journey for uh his secret service and his team to reach us they were in little boats and you know the, the on this river and there was flooding and you know our team that were filming there was saying you know everyone was really on edge but the prime minister was just very calm and i think i saw that throughout our journey whatever we were doing he was actually very very sort of at one and that was a kind of that was cool to see because you never know really what someone's like until you're in a crisis but it was good to be reminded that as a world leader prime minister modi is calm in a crisis that's a good quality but and also i think what shon bright for me was his humility you know he was he was a very humble guy and even though it was pouring a rain and everyone the secret service were trying to get out umbrellas he was going no no i'm fine and then we reached his river and um, and i'd made i'd i'd made this raft out of some reeds and a tarpaulin and i said i think we could get across this using this and the secret service like were like we can't put the prime minister in a little kind of homemade coracle out of grasses and reeds but he was like it's fine we'll do it together and he said bear you get in as well and then the thing started sinking and i thought i can't be in as well so it ended up me swimming pushing him and he was soaking wet and but big smile on his face even through the rain and you learn about people in those moments aapko bata de ki show mein modi ne bataya tha ki wo kis tarah se prakriti se bahut pyar karte hain yuva avastha mein unhone apna kaafi samay himalay ke jangalon mein bitaya hai is show mein unhone kaha tha ki agar aap prakriti ke sath taal mel bana lete hain to prakriti bhi hamari madad karti hai is show ko duniya ke 180 deshon mein dekha gaya tha tv itihas mein is show ka super duper hit hona ye batata hai ki log unhe kitna pyar karte hain You have interacted with President Obama also in the past. Um did you notice any similarities between the two or were they both completely different? Well, I had a huge the huge privilege of taking President Obama uh on a trip to Alaska a few years ago to show him the effects close up of climate change. So in the sense it's similar, you know, an iconic global world leader, uh different terrains. So Alaska was very cold where we went with Prime Minister Modi was obviously rainforests and hot and humid. Uh but what was similar was that they are there for the same purpose which is driving this message of we have to protect the environment we've got to really back big conservation projects 
and we've got to look after our world, you know. And for me, it's really heartening when you see such powerful men like President Obama and Prime Minister Modi stand up and say, together, we've got to do this, you know, together we have the power to do this. And especially India that is now, you know, it's almost the largest country in the world, the biggest democracy on the planet. And such a, such a strong spirit always in India that people want to do the right thing. And protecting our environment and conservation is, is key it's a key role that we all have to do together. It's not one country, it's all of us. Mm. So, yep. And I think protecting our environment and conservation is such a key thing that all of us have to do, not just one country, you know, and I was there for that purpose to try and uh, say, listen, together we can do something good here. Well, it's interesting. I think it's, you know, often you just see politicians behind a podium in a suit looking smart. Uh, but, you know, the wild is a great leveller. It doesn't care who you are. It rewards commitment and courage, and you've got to work together. And we actually got hit by some really big storms and torrential rain whilst we were there. Even just the off-camera journey for uh, his Secret Service and his team to reach us. They were in little boats and, you know, the, the, on this river, and there was flooding. And, you know, our team that were filming there was saying, you know, everyone was really on edge. But the Prime Minister was just very calm. And I think I saw that throughout our journey. Whatever we were doing, he was actually very, very sort of at one. And that was a kind of... That was cool to see because you never know really what someone's like until you're in a crisis. But it was good to be reminded that as a world leader, Prime Minister Modi is calm in a crisis. That's a good quality. But, and also I think what shone bright for me was his humility. You know, he was, he was a very humble guy. And even though it was pouring a rain and everyone, the Secret Service were trying to get out umbrellas, he was going, no, no, I'm fine. And then we reached this river. And, um, and I'd, made, I'd, I'd made this raft out of some reeds and a tarpaulin. And I said, I think we could get across this using this. And the Secret Service like, were like, we can't put the Prime Minister in a little kind of homemade coracle out of grasses and reeds. But he was like, it's fine, we'll do it together. And he said, Bear, you get in as well. And then the thing started sinking and I thought, I can't be in as well. So it ended up me swimming, pushing him. And he was soaking wet, and, but big smile on his face, even through the rain. And you learn about people in those moments. You are seen uh, eating some rather unpalatable food in your survival quests. Did that segment make it to uh, this particular special? Well, the Prime Minister is a vegetarian, so there was going to be no eating of kind of grubs or anything like that. But of course, in the wild, you can survive very well off berries and roots and plants. And, you know, certainly the Prime Minister spent quite a lot of his younger years uh, in the wild. So actually, he was very comfortable with that. Uh, we ended up very cold at the end of this river, very wet, and we shared some beautiful Indian tea together. And for me, that was a special moment. You have interacted with President Obama also in the past. Um, did you notice any similarities between the two or were they both completely different? Well, I had a huge, the huge privilege of taking President Obama uh, on a trip to Alaska a few years ago to show him the effects close up of climate change. So in the sense it's similar, you know, an iconic global world leader, uh, different terrains. So Alaska was very cold. Where we went with Prime Minister Modi was obviously rainforest and hot and humid. Uh, but what was similar was that they are there for the same purpose, which is driving this message of we have to protect the environment. We've got to really back big conservation projects and we've got to look after our world, you know. And for me, it's really heartening when you see such powerful men like President Obama and Prime Minister Modi stand up and say, together, we've got to do this, you know, together we have the power to do this. And especially India that is now, you know, it's almost the largest country in the world, the biggest democracy on the planet. And such a, such a strong spirit always in India that people want to do the right thing. And protecting our environment and conservation is, is key it's a key role that we all have to do together. It's not one country, it's all of us. Mm. So, yeah. And I think protecting our environment and conservation is such a key thing that all of us have to do, not just one country, you know, and I was there for that purpose to try and uh, say, listen, together we can do something good here.